And welcome back, this is Baller Scuba with another episode of Let's Play Super Mario RPG. When we last left off, we were entering the Mushroom Kingdom trying to figure out what the Chancellor wanted us to do about Princess's, Princess Peach's disappearance. And wow, this is like a formal town. What? Bowser's got her again? Oh, kids and their sex. What? He, he knew I was coming? Well, yeah. Whatever. What's up, dude? Nice. Got a bouncy bed. I don't know what happens if you say, yeah, right, kid, because I always love what happens when you say, sure. Watch this. <laughs> nice. Look at him go. Can I jump on him? Yeah. Sweet. Don't tell anybody what happened here. What's up? You, you're, me and your brother so weren't bouncing up and down in, on his bed. What's up? Uh, no. What? Uh, don't look at me, dude. Like, I don't do that. I just jump on people's heads. Like this. That's what I do. No. We've been sleeping together for years. We've decided to finally tie the knot. This is what normally happens when you jump on a bed. You just go nuts. It's actually pretty difficult to try to stay on it if it's not properly in the corner. Whoa, what is up, kid? Uh, what? Like, I don't know what kind of rumors you've been hearing about me, but it's just not true. Catch up on you? It's nice. Whoa. What's up? Uh, no. I'm pretty sure the princess isn't a mushroom. I'm just saying. What's up, Toad? Okay. Uh, I believe this is the inn, this is the item shop, we'll get to that in a second, though. And, hey lady, what's up? Yeah! Oh, bitch. Nobody pulls a prank on Mario! Jump! Urgh, die! Ground pound! Ah, I can't ground pound. What's up? Yeah, yeah. Thanks, twins. Now this is very important, you'll have to keep this in mind if you guys want to play the game, if you want to get 100%. I didn't even know about this until I saw it on another Let's Play. Chase him down, and jump on his face, and then jump up here, and jump up, and you get a frog coin, first hidden chest in the game. Uh, and that's the only time you can do it as far as I can remember, uh, other times you won't be able to go through there. What's up? Uh, probably relieved. I'm sure the princess was a huge burden on his life. See, look, it's hard to stay on the princess's bed. Uh, it's hard to stay in there. And if you look here, we found her. <sighs> oh, you get a mushroom out of it, so it's cool being creepy, kids. You get items out of it. So we go to the other side here. What's going on in here? What's up? Oh, uh, this is the guest room. Anything in here? No, I don't think there is. Jump, jump, jump for my love. All right, we're down here. Are you the vault card? I want what's in the vault. Oh, treasure room. No. Go! Ah, oh, I can't do it. Invisible doors. Invisible doors always get me. I have arrived, sir. Yes, thank goodness. Ew. An ice board in my pants. What? She was coming to my place. 
Yeah, she was coming to my place. And here we learn about something else. Mario, on top of charades, can transform? I don't know if you guys ever knew that. Mario is actually a shapeshifter, so when it's Luigi, he's just uh, playing tricks on you guys. What? Uh, yeah, I totally kicked his ass, and then the princess was all happy, and I went, and then it shook. And somehow I jumped, and yeah. Mario is an expert charades player. He's not very good at guessing, but you get the point. E God, Unassailable! Isn't this a kid's game? How the hell am I supposed to know what unassailable means? Okay. No problem. I'll just be on my way then. Dude. What? And we got a map. Awesome. Dude! Yeah, dude, old people just don't know when to end the conversations. Sweet. Alright, so we get free entry into the vault. Let's go. I like vaults. What's up? Alright, I want this one. Okay, I want this one. Nice. And I want this one. Your treasury sucks. Can I jump on your head? Is there anything up here? No. Yes. Yeah, I do. Freaking Mario. Isn't there a hidden block in here somewhere? I guess not. Let's, let us leave this place if Mario could figure out how to work the stairs. So we're on our way in what? And here we're introduced to one of the many characters in this game that will never be seen in a Mario game again, and I have no idea why. This guy kind of have a, 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 kind of looks like Kate Sith. Oh. Kate Sith with a marshmallow. Not the coin, just the one coin. Like, dude, I've already got like a hundred coins. The hell? Do you just make it rain by crying? Jumping on your face help? No. Uh, I guess he's unconsolable. I guess I could try talking to him. Uh huh. Dude. Ugh. What's with people forgetting stuff around here? Yeah. Whoa. Are there any other Mario's? Then a box of frogs. Who is putting frogs in boxes? Yeah, whatever. Let's go. What's your name? Yeah, he doesn't look- okay, he doesn't look like a frog. Okay, whatever. Nice. So much better than the Seven Saga music. Yeah, this is the end. In case you need to rest or save up. You can't get these stars. These stars don't count towards your seven. I've tried. Be so easy that way. So let's go into the first item shop of the game. And not jump on the counter. What? You know Malo? What? Ha! That sucks for you, I'm not giving you shit. Um. Nice for talking to this guy, we get a pick-me-up that's like a... We call it a phoenix down, it's a revive. Uh, 
Um, and the seventh socket was called out Magic Water, now that I think about it. Yes. What am I looking for? Um, I will need shirt. <laughs> I, I don't think I've ever said it in my life. I will need shirt. I will need pants. I require pants. Um, I can only get one of these. So let's go with uh, antidote because jump. I mean, I, I'm gonna hardly use jumps as far as I can tell. All right, so then let's go ahead and equip some of this stuff. Mario gets the shirt. What? Give me one second, folks. Okay, so apparently trying to move the shirt over from here to here freezes the game. I'm not exactly sure why. So Mario requires a shirt. Uh, he goes around for the rest of the game with no pants, apparently. He only needs shirts. I guess the overalls are enough? I don't know. I'm going to give him the antidote pin as well. And Mallow requires pants. He goes for the rest of the game with no shirt, apparently. So there we go, fully equipped. And what is up, Toad? Why are you jumping? Yes, sir. Kind of. Yes, I am a transformer robot in disguise. You have a bazooka, dude? Yeah, when I was a kid, I did not pick up on the sarcasm here. You know, why didn't you get him? Ugh, I left my bazooka at home. God. And there he goes, and we spin in circles, because that is what you do. And, wow, he likes Sonic dust, man. Anything else? Okay. So when we come back, I will move on and try to fight off that crocodile. Get Mallow's coin back. I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.